Okay, everybody, white sheet time. Anyways, uh, this is John Starkiller. Um, I just got my CF install. This was a rough one for me. It was uh, eight or nine out of ten as far as installs go. I, man, I, I don't know if it was because I was sick this weekend or what, but I had this thing together, take it apart together, take it apart four or five times. Uh, just little uh, nuisances here and there that. Every time I did it, I had to take it apart and resolder. And of course, it's not an easy take apart. Um, the the underneath here, underneath the shroud is where the connections are made. And I'm using a blue, blue, white LED for a clash flash. So two blues in series and one clash flash. So I got four wires going through here. Then of course I got my switches underneath here. Um, two switches, two momentary switches. Um, and then of course I got you know all the LEDs for the crystal chamber. I even have a white LED that does go with the clash flash, but uh, it didn't come out as bright as I thought it was. Um, it looked like it at first, but uh, actual running it doesn't come out that great. Uh, then next in this series section here, in this section here I have the crystal focus uh, right after the crystal chamber crystal focus in here because I got two. Lion, um, uh, 14500s in this section here with the speaker uh, and I mounted a kill switch here uh, so I can get to it but uh, I will say this this is one gorgeous saber this is solidly built um, everything on this I did change this out only because I, I like having something in a thumb that I can you know tighten down real easy uh, I don't need tools or anything with so that's an improvise right there but uh, man I mean you know from the, the, the crystal in the end here um, the actual crystal that I have uh, uh, in the chamber that John put in there for me the weathering on this thing this thing is sturdy well built um, none of the problems that I had installing this had anything to do with uh, John's work whatsoever it was strictly uh, just getting the CF and everything mounted in there but I'm going to go ahead and uh, first of all I wanted to uh, show the size of this thing so I'm going to pull up my Mary Jade uh, which is kind of a relatively small saber it's about 12 inches saber so you can see it's about a 14 inch saber from top to bottom which is nice I like longer sabers um, now uh, for the install real quick here uh, actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull out the plug and I'll put the blade in and tighten that down there we go so let's see here I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna boot this guy up here we go and uh, you can see the crystal in there blinking I got all four blue LEDs in there so they kind of stagger on and I'm gonna turn it on there we go and you can see Kind of getting brighter and lighter, brighter and lighter. I don't know if you can really see that or not. But there's the uh, the white the white flash. Can't really see it on the crystal. Definitely see it on the blade. and uh, there it is this is uh, one awesome saber I'm telling you this is um, this is my supermodel girlfriend here this thing is sweet uh, John see if I can get some now that I'm not standing in the light here see if I can get some good pictures of it images here for everybody to look at there you go There's, and it's flush that's, that's all flush there this thing is awesome. I mean, he did a hell of a job on this thing. Yep, that goes to the top shelf there. Uh, John, you did an awesome job on this thing, man. And uh, thanks. Gravy out.